Breakdown of the five key phases of strategic management. 1. Goal setting, charting the course. This phase is like setting sail on a ship. You define your mission, the ship's purpose, your vision, your ultimate destination, and your values, the principles guiding your journey. You also set clear goals, waypoints, that mark your progress towards your vision. 2. Analysis, understanding the waters. Before setting sail, you need to understand the sea. This phase involves both internal and external analysis. Internally, you assess your ship's strengths, powerful engines, and weaknesses, leaky hull. Externally, you analyze the environment, market currents, trends, competitor ships, their strategies, potential storms, threats, and new technologies, advanced sales. 3. Strategy Formulation – Choosing the Route Using the information from your analysis, you decide on your best course of action. This includes allocating resources, crew and supplies, to different areas, choosing your competitive position, avoiding rough seas or navigating through them, identifying your target markets, islands you want to trade with, and setting priorities, what's most important to reach your destination. 4. Strategy Implementation – Putting up the sails Now it's time to translate your plan into action. This involves aligning your entire ship, organizational structure, with your chosen route. You need clear communication, orders to the crew, strong leadership, a skilled captain, and change management, adapting to different winds. 5. Evaluation and control, staying on course. As you sail, you need to constantly monitor your progress. Are you on track? Are there unexpected currents? This phase involves checking performance metrics, like speed and direction, identifying deviations from your plan, going off course, and making adjustments, steering adjustments, to ensure you reach your destination. By following these five phases in a loop, organizations can continuously improve their strategic decision-making and navigate the ever-changing business environment.